Good morning. I'm Eric Osterhouse with Paragon Ag Advisors. It appears that the corn and soybean markets are still stuck in a range as no one seems willing to get too far out of their comfort zone, at least until we get some sort of ink spilled on an actual deal with the Chinese. It appears as if all other fundamental news are going to continue to take a back seat, at least until that deal is done. Unfortunately, we can't say the same thing for the wheat market. The recent break has brought us to new contract lows, and it appears the funds continue to add to their net short position. Many have banked their bullish hopes on wheat to the belief that Russia would have to reduce their exports in the first quarter of 19, and that the world would need to turn to the U.S. However, that simply has not happened, and we continue to lose out on wheat bids as they go to our competitors. The wheat bulls have been ground down over the last several months, and they're going to be pretty cautious going forward. The real question in regards to the future of the grain markets is what effect it will have on the grain markets once the deal is done. The simplest and most direct outcome is that most are expecting to see the markets move higher, in particular the soybean market. However, we've been talking about this news for a very long time, and while many assume that it will happen, there is no guarantee. We could see this scenario where just the opposite happens, at least for a little while. We still may get a knee-jerk reaction higher, but it may not last very long. Take advantage of any white swan events and have some orders lined up in order to take advantage of any of those sudden moves higher. As always, if you have any questions on these or any markets, call us today at 888-452-8751. Have a productive day.